Hey guys, what is up? I am Devil Driven, and we got Manti back in the house. What's up, Manny? Hey, how's it going, man? Finally got my internet fixed. I'm I'm able to go back. You know, feels good, dude. Yeah, when you don't have it, it's like you you, you don't uh, you just forget what it's like to not have internet. You're like, man, you look at your phone and you're like, oh man, I ain't got no internet. It's like. <laughs> I'm Christ, using up my minutes. It's like shit. I, I was crying in the bathroom. It was it was a mess. I was I was completely destroyed, guys. Yeah. Uh, but today we're gonna play some uh, uh, Impetuous Panda. He made a Reaver Hunter list, and me and Manny are gonna try and give it a go. I did switch one card though. He has Eskel. I put in Philippa for it. I just I I always seem to get screwed with Eskel not getting a good target, but. Philippa, you drop her on the board, and, and she just goes haywire, so I figured it was a good fit. But uh, what do you think about the deck, Manny? I, the deck is actually like very interesting, and the very first thing that I popped in my eye, I was like, wait a minute, this is not Hansel, you know? Right. And um, so uh, the deck definitely looks interesting, definitely looks like you can get uh, out of hand quickly, but it also looks like the mulligan is a nightmare. <laughs> yeah, yeah, when you got infantrymen and commandos you're you're asking for a for a, a bad time <laughs> i guess that's why the tutor's in here to hopefully uh get rid of one of them if you do mess up so but we've yeah. never we've never played the deck so this is the the first run through so no guarantees we'll see how it goes though but this is actually the best like sometimes like you know we schedule like videos and we make the best so it you can look the best and just be creative wise have like content right there but i actually like these kind of videos when you uh just try it for the first first time and see the progress that the players do or the people do with the deck that you're just playing for the first time yeah because if if me and manny can win with it it's, it's gotta be decent <laughs> true true that's a that's a fair point right there right, so let's play some games see how it goes Man. Actually, I think that the Dolba Tenor Protector is the reason why Esco does see more play. It's really hard to get uh, value against as es Coyotel. Yeah. Yeah, it's uh, it's definitely tough. Yeah, um, it's, it's kind of weird because, like as I say, Esco is one of my favorite cards, but like the realist realistically speaking, every time I go against es Coyotel, I just mulligan him away. He's like, oh, I see you. Yeah, it, it, you can't really do nothing with it. Unless you're running your own faller, you know what I mean? You can run it. But... Yeah, the best thing you're going to get is one eight points on the it is how I punish those on the far seat, I think. Right. <coughs> All right, so the nightmare begins. Let's see what we got for the mulligan here. Jeez, what is going on with my video here? Oh, it's a little bit laggy, but it's okay, man. Trust me, it's better. It's laggy internet than I, I, internet I inherited your bad internet, Manny. <laughs> 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 Holy cow. All right, so... Mulligan is not so bad right here. We're dropping a commando. Dropping another commando. And I guess we That's... drop a reaver hunter, huh? But then, then you reach the infantry, right? At what point do you... Or do you keep the... You don't care oh, yeah, if that's... you draw more... No, because I don't have the... The Dun Banner or the Tutor guy. The Banard Tutor. So I think okay. We, I think we keep it. Alright. <sighs> oh, man. And we go Punish. first. So we go... Infantrymen, you think? No, I think we, we start buffing with the... The Quen? What's it called? The Scouts? No, the with scouts. the... Yeah, I think that the scouts would be better. Your no, overall is a solid play. Things are deck as well. So we are pretty much relying right now on uh, Kira Metz pulling that frost, correct? Yeah, it's it's looking rough right now. <laughs> <laughs> this... We could play. We could play our uh, operator. To pull the Reaver Hunter. That's actually like uh like as as old as it looks, it's not that bad, man. Whoa, he just assassinated that. Holy cow. Yeah, dude, that's actually is that, I did not expect that. Is is it that serious? 
So. Wait, we we do the what's it called? We give him a river hunter, right? Yeah, we can do that. Cause that, that play is for, the, for sure. <clears throat> okay, honestly, dude, I wasn't expecting that assassination. No, me either, man. That was that was brutal. Well, should we start with the white frost? Start just putting the the numbers on that. We can. You think he'll clear it? Think he's got Vanamar? Well, if he if he clears it, that's still pretty good, right? Because uh, you end up with a uh, with gold value on the board. Boy, I don't like men who turn me down. It's running really slow. I don't know what's going on here. The curse of the bad internet. Yeah, I might not even get Aromancy off here. No! <laughs> no! <laughs> Jeez. The... If he, if he clears, we can... Well, we have a few options here. Do we just pass? Hang on. Let me or do see. we play the infantryman? Uh, I think we can. <sighs> okay. Huh. What if we pull a scout with the reinforcements? That will buff everything, right? Humans. Yeah, that's not too bad. Because also now now we have twelve cards on the deck. This way if he plays something else we can actually start getting some kind of rivalry that I value, I guess. Please wait, Your Excellency. I'm falling behind. Okay, so I think the other options right now are Bridalbid, uh, Quen, uh, what else? Well, if we rat of it, he's just gonna pull it back, right? True, but like, uh, he's actually, uh, you're right. Huh, turns out that is really good against Bridalbid, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Well, uh, Gwen can be used with C Seal. Um, Alright, we're going with Gwen. Alright. That was actually a really good decision you made because, you know, if, if we lagged... And, uh, <laughs> right. We drop a card. Yeah. Please wait, Your Excellency. I'm falling behind. That's strange that it's running like that. Yeah, but you know, the sacrifices we must pay. Now we do. We, does Radovid put us up? Uh yes, he does because we have. He will put six, and he will hit the six and the ten. We're hitting the two. Uh... I think we hit the ten and the six. Because the other the other is gonna have exponential uh, strength, so if he replaces it, it will come back as a six anyway. Right. <clears throat> oh man, those river hunters! So he does the ring for combo. No one can hide from me. So we either go down two cards, or he escals or menos that and wins it. Right? Huh. 
He can actually, well, I was going to say he can actually overdose too. What do you think? Uh, let me see. What's our uh, summoning circle on? Cantarella. Probably Cantarella, but that puts us even. He goes. So you want a Cantarella? No, I'm. I'm thinking because if he if he can't if we Cantarella. He's up. Yeah. But winning one down doesn't matter, right? Because mm -hmm. we can open pass. All right, sure, man. We'll... No one can hide from me. Yeah, we can get better. That's probably good for next round. He's going to pass. Yeah. What do, you, what do you think, Manny? Well, we have one extra river hunter. Mm hmm. Now, well, the question is, like, do we play it? Or do we play the German and Tudor? I think the Tudor is better, right? To play, like. Yeah, I don't. Well, it depends. We didn't play this, so. Well, we can mulligan. We're going to have a mulligan, right? In the blacklist. So I think. <sighs> this. I think we'll go with the Tudor, dude. Because this way we won't have to blacklist uh, uh, another card. Alright, now, does this deck open pass in the second round? I think you would have to, especially with this. Oh, that's not bad. We could pull our last Reaver Hunter. We need a okay. spell for that, though. So, so then open pass is the way to go, right? Yeah, because we already went like. We're gonna be able to pull all the Reaver hunters, which is cool. Just hopefully he doesn't have rot tossers. <laughs> Those damn rot tosser. Yeah, because it's gonna eat up this like. <clears throat> well, I guess we could just play it on range. A bit of blood letting. Really? Boy, I hope he gets something stupid. Oh, okay. Uh, that's actually a lot of value that he's missing, I think. Because that's six in over eight turns, dude. That thing can do a lot of damage. Yeah, and that's all of them now, right? He has yeah. none of them left, unless he has, like, a seer and he puts them back in the deck or something. But I doubt that. Oh, jeez. It's okay, because okay, we can blacklist that. Ooh, that's a good one. That is really good. This yeah. is a this is a dead card though. Okay. We can just show that there's a dead card. I shall flog them So we play We play the seven first, right? Because there is no that is dead dead the I see. Try to set up a commander's horn row just in case. Hmm. Interesting. Oh, that's right. You you do have that option, the commander's horn. Yeah, Dijkstra might pull it. Yeah, you're right. The smart, sir. This got a pretty big boy option. <laughs> of the bad, yeah, yeah. I was yeah, it's pretty. I guess so. It's only really thirteen, but it's gonna grow like crazy. Yeah, and he has like synergy with other cards. Like that five is gonna give two to other uh, what's called uh, of those cards. Still, it's, I think it's pretty legit. Oh wow. Okay, so um. Hmm. I guess I guess we can do the I I think I guess we can do the five. Get that set up for the commanders. But I don't wanna die. So that pulled us even, that was pretty good. Mm-hmm. 
Now, if, if, uh, what's it called? Uh, Philippa does through like the entire damage, right? Regardless if there's not enough cards, it just keeps going. It just can't hit the same card twice. Okay. So on this situation, we want to use it on... What's his name? On the four, right? So he won't use it again. For example, right now, because because he can uh, he can emir into that uh, Kahir. So why don't we kill the Kahir? No, he can't. He can't pull back golds. He cannot pull the gold golds. Okay, fair enough. So then, so then we have to wait on that one card. Uh, the, this means that we have to do a river hunter. I'll probably Reaver Scout into the other. Yeah, because Reaver this hand. way. <clears throat> Sorry. So he's gonna kill that with Menno. Okay, but... so we have to pull the other one. But we're broke as shit peddlers. Don't recognize your old mates. Hopefully he doesn't run. Well, Scorch doesn't matter because he has a twenty-four. Now we Dijkstra, huh? And hopefully we don't pull that blue stripe. <laughs> Watch it. Ho you're gonna have to make a highlight. Hopefully we don't put this blue stripe. Boom. Right. Let's go. Man, he's up by a lot. Let's see the swing, man. Let's see the swing. Come on. Good, nice combo. Give us our gold Natalis first. Yeah. <laughs> All it. right. If it lets me, geez, I don't know what's going on with my internet. You jinxed me, man. <laughs> sorry, man. It's, I'm sorry, I know. I went through this, dude. I went through this. Oh my goodness, dude. That was that swing was intense. Burn the whole deck out, though. Holy. That what, what do we have left? First light? First left light, the, that's it. Yeah, right? Yeah. This is 15 and we got two 20s. Oh, so he's gonna... He can't replay Menno. Yeah, I was gonna say. So now we... Yeah, Boy, I look guess at this. we... Look at this Igni. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, I don't think he... he... Do they run Igni? No. If, he, if they do, he's gonna have a, like a highlight right here. But, uh... Yeah, it's time for uh, Philippa. Jeez. I don't know what it hit. It's, it's a surprise. Right? The worm, I never know. Pretty good, Philippa. It hit every target. It even took out I, here. I, I'm not sure because remember, I. Oh, I, I'm a bit... no, we lost. Okay, yeah, because he's gonna, he's gonna Amir this, and hit it. Yeah, and then it's gonna grow again. Oh man! This is no time to whimper. And it was, it was good attempt. The north shall yeah, I wonder so what the last the card is. It has to be a gold, right? Uh, his... What? Oh yeah, he'll just use it as the ambassador. Really? He's using it that way, huh? Yeah, he just demolished us with that. <sighs> that combo is legit, man. That's pretty good. That that was impressive uh, spy work right there. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but not for much, dude. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> that was only impressive spy work right there. Yeah. yeah, these just got, I mean, 30 point. Yeah, definitely. It hung pretty tough. It's just that, uh... And Dijkstra did his job. He just... Having those two 
brigades last round was just stupid. Dude, definitely. He put up some work. He was like, dude, uh, you, you look rough right now. Let me hook you up. And then he did his work, man. All right, let's try one more. Mm-hmm. It did get some good strength in the end there. I mean, we had 112. It's just, I mean, when you have a 41 point brigade, it's kind of hard. But... <laughs> uh, I was, I was super impressed. Like we had one card left. Yeah, full test. This is why I don't play Eskel too, man. The minute you run into full test, he's a dead card. All right. Oh man. Uh, let's let's see what else. We got. I got rid of two of the commandos. I'm gonna first slide or Quen. Let's try. Or commanders one. Yeah, let's drop commanders one. Oh, punished. Oh, we could <laughs> we can mulligan them though. It's okay. It's okay. We we didn't go first. I feel, I feel... Attack! Oh, we don't have a bronze spell in our hand, though. Well, we do, we do first slice, right? But, like, uh, I think we start with, this, with the stripes, just so we can actually have a, a chance to get a good card. Mm-mm-mm-mm. Oh boy. Okay, so we're against machines. We we'll put on a different role though, right? Because this way it won't give uh, value to the other machines. And we don't have the bronze. He's gone. Oh my god. Yeah, this one's gonna be rough, man. We're gonna get punished, dude. You one of us or not. Okay, so really? we have already a 13 point difference. That's pretty bad. Yeah, the good thing is that we didn't go first, right? Right. Uh now the question is do we pull? Do we use this scout to pull the other scout, or do we use the two river hunters? I don't know. We burned through the list pretty good, so if we, because we're gonna, we should be able to mulligan this out. Let's do it. Yeah. All right. Also, uh, let's see this. Uh... Oh my goodness! This is gonna be rough, man. <laughs> I wonder. I wonder how much he's gonna push. If he has the uh, the reinforced siege masters or whatever that flip these, he'll probably play this again. I don't know. I've, I haven't seen anybody play the reinforced ballistas. Mm, you you also told me that the machine deck is one of the, your favorites as well, right? Oh yeah. The I like playing the regular ballistas though because. Against Skellige, they, they kind of line everything up. Everything's later, like around 8 to 9, and you could just keep hitting them over and over and over again. <laughs> oh, we burned the good card, so we're out now, for sure. Okay, so that's that's a gold. Yeah, we cannot keep up with that. If we had this, we would have been okay, but... The question is, do we, do we send a, a bronze? Do we send a bronze uh, spell? So, but then we can use a turbiner. Mm, we'll have to see. Oh my God, this is gonna be. But if he pushes, we're we're in big trouble. You know what I mean? All right. Maybe we'll try for it next round. Reinforcements. Okay. <clears throat> 
Hopefully he just passes. Beautiful. Okay, so then what you what do you play with this? Like just probably just play the tutor again. All right. Because first light would okay. Yeah, first light's either gonna pull an infantryman. Well, it's gonna pull a reaver hunter no matter sure. what. Because we're gonna get the infantrymen out, so that works out pretty good. Okay. What about your mulligan? What are you gonna? Uh, hopefully, we get we won't get the the guys. What's it called the reinforcements? Oh, of course we did. <laughs> of course. All right. That's all right. So we got all three reaver hunters. We didn't draw it. Hardly. Well, we got John Natal. I guess though, Dijkstra will be a good, a good pull. Yeah, I think we're gonna go through most of the deck again. I think we start with the sixes, right? Yeah, I don't think we got a choice. Or do we start with one? <clears throat> actually, well, if if we if uh, Dijkstra pulls uh, Seal, we can actually use Gwen, right? Yeah, but she only pulls the. Oh, it's a so then it will, it will change. Yeah, it will change. So we play the six. Oh, they're gonna take the damage for sure. Yeah. What's... I think rather be rather be this actually going to get like a lot of like um, value because we can what. Okay, this is going to be... So he has a soldier and an officer in hand because he mulliganed two cards. <clears throat> okay. Do we start with a... Okay, now, this is the part where I'm confused. We just lay it down on the, on like, on the board and it's like, this is what we got? We can reinforcements for operator. Really? We, we can? Oh, do that. all right. Oh, no, it's a no play a bronze silver soldier. Oh, yeah, I was going to yeah. say, yeah, I don't think we can. We but... could, this seals a mage. Uh, let's just Gwen for right now. Oh, wait. No, we, the River Hunter is fine. Let's go with the River Hunter, man. Don't recognize your old mates. Oh, look at this, though. <clears throat> No, but it's gonna change in a second. And he has a higher card, so it's actually pretty good. Dude, if this guy has like a raw, a raw epidemic, I'm done, dude. I'm done with the game. <laughs> I actually really like this concept that... Uh... Okay, so he's blocking it. Oh, not bad. Um... What's first light? First light is on what? A river hunter for sure. Yeah. Do we use it? Might as well. That protects the six. Oh, sure. Yeah, we can put there. That's fine. Um. All right. I'll play the other one on this row. I think my order of uh, my order of play is absolutely definitely off, man. Like like that plan, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Uh, just so you know, that actually gives you um, that gives you an opportunity to copy another river hunter with your summon circle. circle. I think this is a dead card, though. It might, yeah. It is, actually. This DJ Extra is going to have to come through huge for us. The, the DJ Extra is going to have to do like this. It's going to have to do Gator Mets, right? 
an operator. Yeah, we might play him. Well, we could play John Natalis and Commander's Horn. Just to get it out of the way. All right, I'm I'm down. I'm down. Come on. Rolling the dice. Rolling the dice. Dark clouds gather over the meadow. See, I am. What am I afraid of the the Quen? I, I don't even know why I have the Quen when uh, it's gonna have to. It can actually do another combo, right? It can do uh, Dijkstra into Seal into buffing something else, we draw a card, then after that, uh, it goes to... Kira Metz, uh, hopefully. Kira Metz, yeah. Or Philippa, one or the other. Oh my god, that, that would be beautiful, I'll tell you that. That would be absolutely beautiful. Ooh. Alright. We lock uh, that, or do we wait a turn? I think we wait a turn, right? We do, uh, it's attempted for the GG Extra. Let's see what he pulls. Kira Metz, cool. Okay, so then that puts a... Uh... White Frost. Mm-hmm. Probably... Probably play it here. No, we'll play it on the melee. I mean, on the middle. <laughs> but it's okay. It, it's on me go... Oh, oh! And now we hit something like, yeah, the back. <laughs> you like my special effects? Yeah, dude. We got it. I, I think we got it, man. We're up by 30. 41. So we gotta do one next. Or oh, it depends. Maybe uh, maybe a lock if he plays a, another drummer. He's gonna clear it. He's gonna try to clear it. Yeah, for sure. So now we play one, right? Yeah. He used his other machines, though. I don't, I, I, I'm really confused on what his finisher is for this list. It's probably going to be like Witcher's, dude. What is it? How many silvers did he use? Uh, One. Reinforced. So maybe might be Witcher's. But he doesn't have the siege supports or nothing to buff him up or anything. I don't... All right. So now we Radovid. Or so no. we Radovid? No, we. What about if we use the Death Card? Yeah, we could do that. Surprise! <laughs> <coughs> yeah, that's. We we probably should have mulliganed that. Uh, to hit the three and the two. So like hopefully they come on the right. Yeah, there you go. All right. All right. So we played eleven, right? This is no time to whimper. A couple of them jumped up. Yeah, yeah, they only got two points of value really in there, because right now it actually I gave our white frost more value. Ooh. So we lost. Now we lock. Two. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Long live Seven. So his last card's gonna be a Dun Banner Heavy Cavalry. Checkmate. We look that, and we look the five or the yeah, right. Twenty-four, man. Twenty-six. What card does it? Dude? Fucking the big. This guy got big. No. Oh. Okay, dude. I, if he if he had big me, I would have been like no. Well, yeah, that would have been stupid. A forty. <laughs> Holy cow. That was good though. It it, it plays all right. It, it does go through the whole list pretty well. Yeah, it, it it's it's like if you used hand salt, you'd melt yourself in the first round. <laughs> yeah, dude, this crazy. Like, uh, this answers my question. Pretty much, you go through your entire deck. It's it's very legit. And I'm telling you, like, we're for sure like misplaying this. Like, I'm gonna win that idea. Yeah, like, we uh, the, the Quinn. The coin is something that we can we can work on. The reinforcement is something we can work on. Um, you know, in even if with that with those changes, I think that we can 
we can adapt to the deck and actually play much better. I really think that we don't make honor to this deck as it's supposed to be. But, dude, it's legit. I like it. Yeah, I, I, I love this combo, uh, Kira Metz with, with White Frost. I think it's just awesome. Um, and it, it's cool to see the Reavers Hunters come back in a in a milder form, you know what I mean? They were up to 11, you know, and they keep going up, so... And you could get up to five of them with the Operator and then uh, Summoning Circle. We actually did get the Summoning Circle off, which was cool. So, yeah, yeah. Good, good good games, Manny. Uh, I'll... I'll throw it over to you to let everybody know where they can find you at. And... Well, uh, you know, like, uh, thank you so much for having me, first off. And I just want to let you guys know that uh, the content for Wen City will resume the next Monday. And the reason for this is because, you know, I have no internet and I don't, don't have any content, you know. So for that, you guys can find me on WenCity.com, which sends you into our uh, YouTube page. Awesome. Yeah, we're ready for some new Gwent City stuff. Uh Hopefully some new uh, new stuff with tragic. We want to. We, we like tragic stuff. <laughs> yes, he's, he's, he's incredibly he, insanely he, smart man. He looks at this list and says, "Oh, this is a this is a uh, tough mulligan. Hold my drink. <laughs> <laughs> I can make it better." Right. But yeah, that's the video for today, guys. Like always, thanks for coming through, Manny. We uh, we always like having you through here, and uh, we'll see you guys next time.